just remembered uh, uh, the start and uh, how well they played. I think there was a little bit of a learning curve for our team, but uh, um, that's 12 games ago. I don't know that it has any bearing or even worth talking about. What what's, uh, needs to be said is how much better they are now than they were then, as, as is probably every team in the league, including us. But they've got an elite point guard in Lipsy. They've got a uh, uh, one of the toughest matchups in uh, uh, Selovic. Uh, I really like him. He's a talented kid. Uh, 6'10", 6'11", whatever they got him measured at. He's, he's really good. Smart, tough, uh, good decision maker. Uh, Gilbert Kidd is fearless, tough, aggressive, uh, can score and shoot. Um, I think the thing that makes them is their front line and how well they fit together. Um, uh, they're two fours and they're two fives, and, and they're all they're all really good. Uh, Jones uh, plays with great energy. Rob Jones, uh, Curtis Jones comes off the bench, and um, he's obviously made a major jump. I mean, we're all 11, 12 games into the uh, season now, but he's. He's playing really good right now. I watched a bunch of her games uh, last night, uh, this morning. The first thing that jumped out to me is how much better they are uh, than when we uh, uh, played. Uh, well coached team, very disciplined, physical, play hard. Um, wh whoever plays them, it's, it's, uh, it's going to be a difficult matchup. And we went into a bus song, and they were so much better prepared uh, for the game that we were. Uh, and they jumped up on us 14 nothing. We had some uncharacteristic turnovers, uh, silly turnovers, but they caused those turnovers. They caused us to look bad, how, how well they played. Uh, now, the fact that we came back and took the lead, you have to turn around and give us credit for that, too. But um, uh, I was just impressed with Iowa State. You know, we made a lot of uncharacteristic mistakes, but if you watch that game closely, they caused it. They caused us to make those mistakes. Not, not everybody plays the way they play. You know, it's like it's like us. You know, like people you know, wonder about uh, a team's offense, for instance. No team's offense is going to look really good against a really good defensive team. Like how many great offenses come in here and wonder what would happen to them? It's tough to play on the road and be really good offensively, especially against a team like Iowa State or uh, Kansas, or uh, any of the really good teams. Um, but once you go on the, when you go on the road, it's tough to win, man. It's tough to play good. I mean, you just got to figure out how to, you don't ever evaluate a, a road win. Just win it and get on the bus and go home. That's, that's what coaches say. Win it and get on the bus and uh, uh, go home. But uh, I've enjoyed watching Iowa State. I really like the way they play. I have a ton of respect for that program. Uh, uh, I don't know how many times I've taken teams into Iowa State. Um, not that it's important. But, uh, um, there's not a better fan base. There's some probably as good, very few, but there's, there's not many fan bases that can um, touch them as far as tough places to play. And the thing about them, and this is what I love about our crowd, because our crowd's starting to appreciate how we play, you know. Um, and, and Iowa State fans have forever, uh, but they're, they're a tough matchup.